and welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for stopping by and if you're new around here please make sure you subscribe and press that notification bell so you don't miss any of my uploads. But today, as you might have guessed from the title, I'm going to do a little, well I say a little, collective haul of some bits that I've been picking up lately. Um, since I've started my job and obviously getting my first pay, I have started treating myself a little bit and I've not gone out of control I've just got some bits that I was lacking in my wardrobe or I'm kind of trying to change my style a little bit so I'm just introducing like new colours or new styles into my wardrobe so I've just been picking up bits here and there whilst I've been going out to the shops obviously keeping super safe and stuff not doing it unnecessarily but yeah I thought I'd just show you what I've picked up lately um, it's from a mix of different shops all on the high street and yeah I hope you enjoy and let's get on with it before this video gets too long I'm going to make this video a try on haul because I like doing those I think it shows you what the item will look like on and I think it's super helpful so the first thing I want to show you is actually something that I'm wearing and it's this adidas t-shirt that I got I picked this up in Sports Direct um, in a deal it was two for £33 or it was £20 each so me and my dad got one each he got one in black and I got mine in this really cool mint colour I'll show you what it looks like fully on in the try on clips but I really like this I've been looking for a top like this for ages and they're quite expensive on like ASOS or like online shops like that so when I saw this when we went into Sports Direct I couldn't not have it and it's such a gorgeous colour it's kind of it's a play on quite a trendy colour but you can kind of dress it down so I've just wearing mine with some mum jeans that I got from Primark a while ago and I just really like this it's quite different for me I don't really wear sports brands and stuff but I really like this and I am looking forward to styling it maybe with like some shorts or some skirts so look out on my instagram for this but really good bargain and i highly recommend this because it's super comfortable as well so whilst we were kind of like on a sports vibe or going to shops that i wouldn't necessarily shop in um i got myself some new converse sorry i'm just making sure they're in frame um, I treated myself to some new Converse. I saw, I think it was Alfie Days, he'd posted on his Instagram stories that he brought some new trainers from Size and I've later found out that Size is part of JD and I don't know why that information was needed but I just went on there to see what, how much the trainers that he ended up getting were and then I saw a pair of Converse that I'd been wanting for years. So everyone knows the classic high top um, converse, I've got them in white, I did have them in black but I sold them because I found them super uncomfortable but I treated myself to the classic red high tops. These are the All Star Truck Taylor 70s so they're the kind of like even more classic retro style so the like sole rubber band bit is I think a little bit thicker than the ones that a lot of people wear now but I'm absolutely in love with these I can't wait to style them with like midi dresses like my Zara polka dot midi dress jeans um shorts like denim shorts these are such a good addition to my collection and I actually got them for they were reduced to £45 from £70, which I thought even before I got my NHS discount was it amazing. But I think I ended up getting these for like £35, which is absolutely ridiculous. But I absolutely love these and I can't wait to start wearing them. And I'm so happy I have them in my collection. So those were the two kind of like rogue choices of things I got. And so now on to... H&M and Primark and I ended up picking quite a lot up in H&M because I've really been loving their stuff at the moment and I feel like their sizes have really improved in 
kind of become a bit more accessible, especially when it comes to actually shopping inside the store. So if we start with H&M, and you'll see that I kind of went on a bit of a t-shirt on top spending spree in there. So the first item is this, I don't know what you, it's like a black, I probably would call it a blouse. It's um, one of the ones that you can kind of pull so it makes it tighter at the top and then it will be more of a crop top. Sorry, I always do this, I never learn. Let me just turn my phone on silent. But yeah, I have this in a white and black polka dot and then I saw this in the sale again and I couldn't resist it. It was £7 but it was originally £12.99 which I feel like isn't really that expensive to begin with. It's got this shirred like stretchy back so it's super comfortable and I bought this to wear normally but also for work with some like high waisted trousers and like a little cardigan I think this would look really nice. You can see in the try on clip how it looks on me and I would normally steer away from something like this but I actually really liked it and I want, like I said I wanted to try different styles and stuff and evolve my my sort of personal style a little bit so I'm really happy with this and I really like it and the pattern's really really cute so that was the first item the next few items are all t-shirts because I felt like I was some of my t-shirts I always end up wearing are getting a bit past it now and they're looking a bit old some of them have got holes in it and I'm going to have like a massive sort out of my t-shirts because I've have far too many t-shirts than one person should have and I've got two drawers full of them. One drawer I admit is just for band t-shirts and stuff and I'm not getting rid of any of those because I attach memories to those and I do wear them but when it comes to like slogan t-shirts you get from high street stores I do need to be quite ruthless with sorting them out but I did get some new ones because I know which ones that I'm going to get rid of and I just felt like there was a gap. So the first one is this red stripy t-shirt that has Monchery on it. I've probably butchered that and I can't speak French even though I did it in GCSE. But I really like this. It was 9 99 I got it in an extra large. Or oh, I forgot to say with the blouse. I got this in an extra large and it fits perfectly. I probably could have got away with the large because it is quite big especially with the stretchiness but like I said with H&M their sizes are really getting better so this is like a little bit oversized on me uh, which I really like and I just think it would look good with my new red converse I don't know if that's going to be too much red for an outfit but I'll be breaking it up with like jeans or denim shorts I don't know why I keep wanting to start everything with denim shorts I think it's because the weather's nice but um yeah I really like this pretty standard t-shirt but it's really soft really good quality especially for H&M so yeah that is the first t-shirt the next one can you set sense as a trend I am a lover of stripes and as soon as I saw this I knew I had to get it it is a coca-cola embroidered I don't know if you can see that hope you can it's got the cutest little glass bottle of coca-cola embroidered on the t-shirt and I just thought this was a bit of a difference of a striped t-shirt so it just adds a little bit of interest to it and you don't realise how hard it is to find a boxy striped black and white t-shirt because I got one from H&M in the men's department but then I later realised when I got home that it was blue and I like wearing black and white stripes so I really like this. Again, this was 9 99 and it was an extra large and it fits perfectly. And it's such a good deal and it's definitely going to be something that I can see myself wearing quite a lot, especially with like mum jeans. So the last t-shirt that I got from H&M is actually a collaboration uh, with Desmond Dempsey. I'm not Desmond and Dempsey. I'm not 100% familiar with that. I don't know if I should be, but I saw this t-shirt and I couldn't not get it so it's kind of like this slogan t-shirt that says Palm Cove on it and I just absolutely love like the vintage kind of feel and the vintage look of the print and 
it just screams summer to me and I absolutely love this and this is I feel like this is like a boxy t-shirt again and it was 9 99 which I was really surprised about considering it's like a collaboration with them but I really like this again it's gonna look cool with mum jeans denim shorts probably style it up with some midi skirts that I have as well but yeah really cool really easy thing to chuck on and I absolutely love it so those are all the things in H&M and now let's go on to Primark because you know I like to have a browse in Primark and I picked up some nice stuff. So the first two items that I got from Primark I'll show you at the same time are these kind of basic cardigans but they're in the most gorgeous colour. Make sure they're in frame and I just absolutely love these. These I feel like cardigans some it's like a love hate with, with some people you either love them or you hate them i have worn cardigans for as long as i can remember i find they're a really good way to layer your outfits but also inject a bit of color into an outfit i used to wear them uh, quite a lot with like cami tops so i if i had this probably about five or six years ago i'd probably pair it with like a white cami or a polka dot cami and that would be an outfit sorted with for me with um, some skinny jeans but there's a trend at the moment of wearing these as tops which I quite like and I got these both in extra large as you can see they're £5.50 so quite a good bargain but they're actually quite good quality for what they are as well I was so close to buying some on New, New Look's website but when I saw these in store I could not get them but I absolutely love the colour. They're really like soft but quite thin so they're not too hot for the weather especially. And I've got these in an extra large which is an 18 slash 20 and they fit perfectly. I just love the colour. They're like kind of pastel colours so really cute addition to my wardrobe. And they'll be perfect for work but also to wear with like midi skirts or jeans as a top. So yeah couldn't go wrong with those. So the last two items are both tops. Can you tell that I went on a bit of a top spending spree? I felt like I was just lacking some like everyday tops that I could just chuck on with some jeans or a skirt. So I went on a bit of a mission to try and find some and to like kind of refresh my wardrobe. So the next top is this absolutely beautiful kind of embroidered blouse and I, oh my god I just love this I did originally buy this for work to tuck into some high waisted um, trousers but I just know this is going to become a staple in my wardrobe it's literally such an easy thing to chuck on if you're going for a nice meal or a picnic or just for a day out shopping it's it's quite a thick material but it's also quite floaty and thin and then it's kind of got like a scoop a uh, lower scoop at the back and you'll see what this looks like on in the trunk clip but I just absolutely love this so it was £13 and I got it in a size 20 because I wasn't sure how forgiving it would be like across the um like chest so I just wanted to get it a little bit bigger but I don't think it really matters too much and I just absolutely love this and I'm so glad I found it. I kind of I saw it in a random place within my local Primark, in like a size eight, and I was like, oh, I need to try and find this. As you do when you find something you love in Primark, you can never then end up finding it in the shop. But I found it right at the back of the shop, behind loads of random T-shirts. I was like, yes, it was meant to be. So yeah really like that and then the last item again is something for work but I could probably wear this normally especially with like some linen trousers that I got a few weeks ago in Primark but it is this kind of linen like natural hessian colour sort of blouse I quite like the sleeves they're quite puffy so it adds like a little bit of detail to such plain um, blouse but I got this in the 20 again and it was actually reduced. It was £5 from £11. So quite a good bargain. But like I said, I was like lacking just plain blouses and tops that I could just chuck on. Especially for work. I'm not really wanting to 
think too much about what I'm wearing, I just want to be comfortable. So I really like this and you'll see in the try on clip that it's such an easy thing to chuck on. So yeah, really happy with that and even more of a bargain because it was reduced. So I forgot to mention that I picked this little brown croc print bag from Primark that was £6. I was lacking a like tan brown bag for some of my outfits because I like to match my accessories so this did the job. So those are all the things I picked up. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you would like to see some more hauls from me from any stores in particular please let me know in the comments below or via DM on Instagram. I love doing hauls. It's an excuse to spend money but obviously I am spending it on things that I want to but if you like this video please make sure to give it a thumbs up and I shall see you next week for a brand new video. Bye!